Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Dr. Lee and I come from Bukit Matajam, Penang. Right now, I'm staying in Kluang, Johor. And uh, welcome to my program, to my YouTube channel. I'm actually now in the second phase of uh, this book, of which many of you bought this book. So I have already finished teaching the whole book. In fact, every question in this book, I have done on the whiteboard in my YouTube channel. And now, it is the second phase. So after uh, I finish around 50 to 60 videos, maybe around 60, because of some of the lessons needed around five videos or even six. And I stopped for a while, a few weeks, because uh, I wanted to give time to those people who bought this book and didn't have enough time to do or uh, they needed to watch the video several times before they could uh, understand perfectly and then do the exercises. So I stopped for a few weeks and of course now I'm back. All right. And this time I'm back, I'm still doing the 38 lessons here. All right, you can see that this book has 38, 38 different parts of grammar, like adjectives, adverbs, tenses, nouns, verbs, positive, negative, sentences, questions, question words, you know, question tags. So uh, actually, to tell you the truth, if you have these 38 different parts of grammar in this book. If you have all this and you are able to uh, understand and do all the exercises connected with these uh, 38 chapters, you have actually completed what is um, what you should know in grammar. That is why now I have come to this stage whereby I will repeat the whole book. Revision. That is why you can see, I'm now doing this, Dr. Lee's method revision, grammar challenge, based on the grammar challenge, 38 days. Previously, we had a 38 day grammar challenge. So now is the uh, revision time, but uh, you can see that the questions on the board here are not the same as the questions here. Not the same. And in this uh, series of uh, videos, in my YouTube channel, I will make it more interesting by teaching you one exercise and giving you homework to do. All right, based on the exercise, so that it will be a good challenge for you, and uh, you will find it more interesting. So I will now start with uh, the homework I gave you before this. We are still at lesson two. Countable and uncountable nouns. Okay, nouns are names of nouns means people, animals, places, and things. People, animals, and places are countable nouns. But things, you have two groups. One countable, one uncountable. Cannot count. Okay, so countable means you can count. Uncountable nouns means you cannot count. So the last exercise, I gave you homework. I taught you many and much. Many means countable. You can count. One, two, three, four, five. But much, you cannot count. So these are the answers. Okay, these are the answers. You can see how many correct you got. There are 14 here. So you can see how many correct. So, uh, coffee is uncountable, so you cannot say many, you say much coffee. Because much, you cannot count. Girls, you can count. One girl, two girls, three girls, so it's many. Cows, one cow, two cows, three cows, so it's many, you can count. Soup, cannot count. Something that you can drink, usually you cannot count. Dust, 
dust you cannot count very easy. Much dust, much soup, many cows, many girls, much coffee. Schools, of course you can count. One school, two schools and three schools. So it's many schools, many pens because they are countable. Many cars, cars are countable, but milk is uncountable, so much milk. Much curry cannot count. Much rice, the rice that you eat, you cannot count, so it is much. Students, you can count, so it's uh, many students. Hotels and lions, you can count, okay? So many hotels, many lions. Okay, so you can see how many correct you got. Exercise 6, the new exercise. The new exercise is uh, a few, a little. A few is countable, alright? A little is uncountable. So example, cream. The cream that you see on the cake or you put in your coffee, that is uncountable. So a little cream. Coffee is something you drink, uncountable. So a little coffee. Trees, yes, you can count. So a few trees. Snakes, you can count. A few snakes. Monkeys, yes, you can count a few monkeys. Dirt, you cannot count. Dirt is something that is dirty, you cannot count. So a little dirt. Rulers, yes, you can count rulers, so a few rulers. Shops, yes, you can count a few shops. Jam, you cannot count. The jam that you put on your bread, you cannot count. So a little jam. Mangoes, yes, you can count. Therefore, a few mangoes. And this is your homework exercise 7. Try it at home. Next lesson, check your answers with me. Can you count water? If you can, a few. If you cannot, a little. Because a few can count, a little cannot count. Can you count crocodiles? Is it a few or a little? Can you count children? A few or a little? A few can count. A little cannot count. Can you count porridge? Porridge that you eat, can you count? If you can, many are uh, a few. You cannot count a little. Lorries, can you count? Juice, apple juice, orange juice, can you count? Jam, can you count? You put on your bread, jam, can you count? Socks, can you count? Parts, the part that you go and play, can you count? Butter, can you count? You put on your bread, butter. If you can count a few, if you cannot count a little. Alright, so do this for homework at home. And you can check your answers with me the next lesson. And uh, you are now with me, Dr. Lee's method, revision, based on the grammar, uh, challenge 38 days. I am opening an online class. It is the same. It has to be 38 different lessons. Adjectives, adverbs, tenses, um, question words, question text, and so on. 38. During the online class, all the 38 in one. That means I will give you exercises on all 38 lessons all mixed together. So it's rather challenging. Uh, online class is different from YouTube channel. YouTube channel is interesting because you can watch and learn. Online class is a bit different because uh, there is interaction, me and you, communication, me and you. And uh, if time permits, if we have time, you can ask me questions. Alright, so of course during the lesson, I will still ask you uh, questions and see if you can answer me. And uh, if you want, please register. WhatsApp me to register 019-7878. 299. What's app to register? The best you register now because the last day to register is 31 October 2020. The class starts November 2nd. Alright, so that's all for this lesson. Remember to give me a like, share and subscribe. And thank you for watching my videos.